All right, here's a quick show off of my last action hero. Everything is complete. Everything works as it's supposed to. I did a topside teardown on this. By that I meant I removed all these plastics and replaced the rubbers underneath them. I've got new white rubbers. Um, it did come with uh, Titan posts when I had it, so I left the original posts, which are Titan posts, which are really nice. So there's orange ones are there. Um, and uh, replaced the LEDs with two SMD LEDs from Comet, at least on top on the play field. These colored ones uh, came with it when I got it. I didn't change those. And uh, underneath the uh, play field, they're not common LEDs, but they're still LEDs and they're bright uh, and they work just fine. Um, the closest thing to a cracked plastic on here, uh, if you wiggle this little guy a little bit, um, I'm not sure if it counts as cracked or not, it's just a little wiggly in there. Um, but it, if you leave it alone, it stays and works just fine. Um, the uh, cabinet is decent. It's not great, but it's decent. Um, if you start looking at things real close, you can see that there's been some scuff marks from where it's been moved over the years. I've done some touch-up paint on it. Um, you can see where like there was a little uh, wood chip up here that I've uh, you know painted over. Um, there's another one here, and another one here. That right there is the worst spot on the whole cabinet, but um, if it's in a lineup and or um, you're not actively looking for things wrong with it, it's probably not something that you're going to notice. Topper works as it's supposed to, and the play field in and of itself is really nice. I don't see wear spots anywhere in this game. Um, there is, uh, oops, there is, uh, you can tell the game has been played when you look at the shooter lane, but like I said, everything works. And uh, there are cliffy or cliffy knockoff protectors around the scoops. Um, I did not peel these back and see what it looks like underneath them. Uh, most of them and most of the games are pretty trashed, uh, but the uh, protectors there keep further damage from happening and it's something that you're not going to be able to help anyways. But everything in this game works the way it's supposed to, um, which I'll show you here in just a second. Push the start button, you get this lovely animation starting on the wheel. Pull the trigger handle, try to shoot the crane target. Um, rules to the game are a uh, derivative of Adam's family in my opinion. You hit the scoop to start a mode. You hit the um, ramp to restart or to relight the mode. So I'll go ahead and hit the dynamite feature. First one's going to be Ripper's downtown blowout. All targets, whatever. So in order to relight the scoop to start another mode, you hit the ramp. Oops, and you can see it's relit. Hit that again, it starts the next mode. Go to the movies. So shoot either ball for at a ball. So in this particular case, um, it's got two captive balls. Um, this, this game's actually really loaded when you think about it. It's got a six ball multi ball. You can't see it. There's magnets under the play field here that work perfectly. I'll show you here in a minute. You got the moving crane uh, with the extra locks over here. So we've missed the add a ball. You've got the cool crane pop up targets here. So this is really neat. If you're not in a mode and you hit these targets, you have to hit all five of them without hitting this guy. If you hit that guy, it'll reset. So C A N E, shoot for R, miss it. Oh, nope. But you hit all all of them, the grain comes to life. And you hear that wonderful shaker motor going nuts. All right, crane run away. Ball pops in. If it's not perfectly balanced, it doesn't always uh, make it over here or then drop down in there, but it has a virtual lock. So we're covered here. 
Um, but everything on here works like it's supposed to. I'll go ahead and show you the multi-ball real quick so I can show off the magnets. You hit these guys to advance the multi-ball. See? Six more for multi-ball. Five more for multi-ball. Four more. There we go. Three more. Two more. One more. We'll do it one more time. Whoa. Will Jack Slater lose? Multi-ball. Shoot the movie screen. So you got to shoot the scoop up here. Multi-ball ready. So it'll start launching stuff out. Get the jackpot by setting up the ramp. Replay. We'll go back and forth in the middle of the thing. The shaker motor on this is really aggressive. Oh, I forgot to show you the um, the magnets. So let me start the. Here we go. We'll do another multi ball. You got the ripper, it'll shoot back to you. Alright. So there's magnets right under here, under beautiful uh, Arnold. So you hit the multi ball. Come on. Little auto launch. Right. And then after they're out, There we go. So it's hard to see. There we go. Shoot the crane to double down pot. Oh, shoot the crane. Come on. That magnets just came on. There we go. It's kind of hard to see, but you see how they're jerking around there? Those are the magnets under the play field. Hero.